going on guys darkstar coming at you with another video just want to talk a little bit about their launch date for zelda switch version as well as the mario game that was shown off during the switch's reveal trailer all right so before i even get into zelda breath of the wild release date and, and the mario game first i gotta talk about this Mario Kart 8 my boy so we all knew that this game was gonna be coming uh, to the system we saw it in the reveal trailer we saw them playing it pretty much confirmed that we we're gonna get some version of Mario Kart 8 coming to the switch we didn't know exactly what we we're gonna get for it. we saw King Boo which is a character that's not in the current version of the game we weren't sure what we we're gonna get but now after uh, EB games uh, uploaded some actual like box art for the games that were coming out for the switch and some of them have a little bit of more information on the box that might give us a good idea of what we're going to actually be getting. So on the Mario Kart 8 box, we see a little a little uh, picture that I'll be, I'll be showing you guys here. It says all new battle mode, which we all know that we can't stand the battle mode in the fucking uh, Wii U version. The standard version of the game is absolute trash. Everybody knows that we hate that. So it says all new battle mode as well as 24 extra tracks and 10 new characters. Now that is a very, very hefty kind of update so we we usually did get a, uh, we got a lot of new tracks and a lot of new characters for the game during the uh the wii u era but seeing 10 new characters and 24 extra tracks that's basically on top of the tracks that already exist i can't remember the exact number of tracks that were already on the game minus the um not not including the dlc that we got uh as the months went on but 24 extra tracks that is a lot of extra content as well as a new battle mode and 10 extra characters that is a lot of extra content and i'm sure they're gonna price this at 60 dollars but with honestly with, with everything that they're adding the existing dlc that's already on the game the main game itself on top of all this extra new stuff that's really really good so good stuff on nintendo adding a hefty amount of content that people were requesting as well as much needed updates in terms of characters and tracks all right next topic for you guys so i know i've been saying that I feel that Zelda Breath of the Wild was going to be delayed back until June of this year. I can actually say that now. And Mario was going to be our, our launch, our big launch title, first party title from Nintendo with Zelda coming up uh, in the summertime. Cause that's, that's what Lord Kate Dale's been saying. She's been hearing a lot of stuff from her sources from Nintendo of Europe. She, they've been saying that. And even Emily Rogers has been saying that Zelda was probably going to be pushed back from launch to around summertime so honestly they've both been right so often i just i kind of honestly just said you know what, fuck it i'm gonna believe them at this point but now laura kate Dale's coming out she's saying that it, she talked to a nintendo of america source and they claim that the game will actually be ready for march recently she's come out on twitter and confirmed 100 percent that she's seen the finalized material of this this game was definitely coming out during march this is going to launch with the system this is crazy this is absolutely insane on top of that, now that that's just a rumor. That, that's kind of, you know, you got to take it with a grain of salt, obviously. Yes, she's been right a lot of times before in the past, but you still have to take it as a rumor, the grain of salt. But on top of that, Core Core Magazine, a very, very accurate magazine when it comes to leaking information. We saw a lot of that with Pokemon Sun and Moon um, during last year. And now some new screenshots from their magazine has come out showing the release date or Breath of the Wild Wii U version and 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 sorry Switch version will be March of 2017. So just another very reputable source saying that this will be coming out on launch. On top of what Laura K. Dale had recently said about the Nintendo of America uh, source that she spoke to, saying that this game will come out in March, it does kind of sound like this game might just be ready for launch instead of being pushed back in uh, into summer. Now we don't know about it. maybe Nintendo, maybe Europe might get this game pushed back into 20 or into summertime but we don't know what i'm thinking now is because a lot of people were saying that the, that the mario game the mario game that was showing off in the nintendo switch reveal trailer was going to be our big huge launch game which is kind of weird because we, we haven't heard at we've heard literally nothing of this game at all except for one time last year during e3 miyamoto was actually talking about this game he said that they were working on a brand new mario game and that game was going to be coming out probably sometime next year but they were going to be showing it off and talking about it at the next e3 conference now next e3 by the time e3 is out the switch will be released already for a few months we, we would have played all the games the launch games and we would have had a great time so don't you think it's kind of weird 
that all of a sudden we all assuming we're all assuming that this Mario game is going to be ready for launch when Miyamoto himself said that they weren't even going to be talking about this game until the next E3, which will be June of this year, three months after the Switch is already released. So I'm starting to think that maybe that game, maybe that game might be the summer release, if, even if, if at all, if they even have a summer release, which I kind of feel like they should at this point. But if they do do a summer release, I'm thinking it might be this game. They might show it off at E3, and you know, maybe it comes out. You know, they say, oh, next week this game comes out, or July this, game, this new Mario game will be released. But I kind of find it weird how Miyamoto s says that he that they will be talking about this brand new Mario game around E3, and now all of a sudden it'll be ready before E3, you know, and launching before E3 on this brand new. System. It, it kind of doesn't really make any sense because back in 2016, the brand new Mario game that he was talking about he did say that they would be speaking about it during E3 of, of next year, which will be this coming E3. So that's kind of weird. I, I don't know. A lot of stuff is going on lately. I'm not really sure what to believe it at this point. God damn, these rumors are fucking crazy. But I'm, I don't know. I really want Zelda to be at launch. Out of the two games, I would really prefer if Zelda were at launch and Mario would came later on. I do think Mario would probably sell the system a bit better. But honestly, I think it'd be just it'd be better for for us just to get this game out already because we've seen so much of zelda and so much advertising we've seen it at the game awards we've seen it at e3 we saw it at jimmy fallon we saw it so many times over and over again we see screenshots every other day or so and nintendo release there's been so many times that we've seen this game and i just think it's time that they've released it already and from if what the source the nintendo of america source at least in north america because honestly if the switch is region free which we're thinking it is honestly I, I'm going to see a lot of people in Europe just port the game or import the game from uh, from America and just buy it that way because uh, it's it's going to be torture to, to wait months and months for this game to come out when it's already been out in another region, you know what I mean? So we'll have to wait and see. Hopefully, hopefully this game does make it to launch. I really want to play Breath of the Wild. I don't want to see this game at E3 again. I've said this countless times. I really do not want to see this game at E3 another time. I don't want to see this game at any more major events and and after the switch has already been uh, released i don't want to see it anymore it's just time to release this game finally and i think nintendo will be able to do it hopefully it, it, from the looks of the advertising the way the advertising has been looking and on top of the laura kate dale source that she has it does sound like this game might just make it for launch march 2017 so We'll have to wait and see for more information to come out. Let me know what you guys think about all these stories down below in the comment section. Thank you all so much for all the new subscribers. I really do appreciate it. If you guys want to leave a comment down below for anything you want me to talk about, just let me know. Hit the like button if you enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.